The World Economic Forum's initiatives have sparked growth, reshaping the economic landscape for countries around the world. And while often criticized for its elite access and carbon footprint, there is no denying that the summit's influence and the summit has addressed monumental events over the years. And some of the examples include the Berlin Wall's fall, the ascent of economic globalization, and the urgent challenges posed by climate change. It served as a diplomatic catalyst to foster economic connections globally. Davos has not only initiated alliances that successfully vaccinated over a billion children, but also provided a prominent platform for influential environmentalists. Now, the forum acts as a think tank publishing various reports, including the famous Gender Gap Report launched in 2005. And participating nations have also witnessed tangible outcomes. And this includes enhanced GDP growth, job creation, and the establishment of sustainable practices. The Circular Economy Platform and the Trillion Tree Campaign are just a few examples of the initiatives that have left a lasting impact on economies worldwide. However, the summit's climate hypocrisy is still in question. The carbon footprint that is associated with the World Economic Forum meeting in Davos last year quadrupled as a total of 1,040 planes ferried attendees to and from this event. And this surge in emissions prompted climate campaigners to de decry the apparent contradiction between the urgent discussions on climate breakdown at the conference and the conspicuous use of private jets by the wealthy and influential participants. Only time will tell if Davos can truly lead the way to a more sustainable and equitable future.